Overlooking St. Peter's Square, Pope Francis prayed for an Italian priest who was kidnapped in the Middle East two years ago. Tra qualche giorno ricorrerà il secondo anniversario da quando in Siria è stato rapito Padre Paolo Dall'Oglio. Rivolgo un accorato e pesante appello per la liberazione di questo stimato religioso. It was on July 29, 2013, when Father Dall'Oglio was kidnapped in the Syrian city of Raqqa a city that's turned into a symbol of targeted attacks carried out by the Islamic State. The priest was returning to Syria after being forced out by the government for criticizing the rule of Bashar al-Assad. He made his way back to the northern part of the country, where jihadists were imposing their rule. He was hoping to mediate so that kidnapped hostages would be freed. Instead, he too became a victim. Early reports suggested groups linked to al-Qaeda carried out the abduction. Other sources claim the priest is in a prison managed by the Islamic State between the cities of Raqqa and Aleppo. In his appeal for his release, the Pope also prayed for two Orthodox bishops, Bulos Jasihi and Gregorios Ibrahim, who disappeared back in April 2013. This after calling on local authorities to take action and protect religious minorities. Auspico il rinnovato impegno delle competenti autorità locali e internazionali affinché a questi nostri fratelli venga presto restituita la libertà. The Pope has made it a point to stay in touch with the family of Father Dalloglio. Last summer, during a luncheon, he met in private with his seven brothers, offering them a few words of encouragement. The Pope went even further in his appeal by asking that all hostages abducted during war be freed. In Syria, there are many religious whose whereabouts are still unknown, among them Father Jacques Murad and Father Antoine Boutros.